Welcome back, friends and family, to Wander on a Whim. This week was jam-packed for us, so I wanted to highlight a couple things. First of all, the Mayakoya Tea Ceremony, where Sean was the favorite student, making the foamiest matcha tea. Afterwards, they let us take pictures in their gardens wearing our kimonos. The rental shots were super fast, dressing and undressing, so stop by before seeing the sights. Afterwards, we had Kyoto lessons with our Kyoshi in Kyoto. He spoke absolutely no English, but gave us a whole bunch of textbooks to read, and then his translator filled in the blanks. But even though those were fun, there was one day that we were looking forward to the most. March 23rd. Our anniversary! And supposedly, it was supposed to be the perfect day to see the cherry blossoms in Kyoto. But... We're at an anime convention! Yep. And I guess what day it is today? It's anniversary day! Oh, 11 years of marriage. 11 years. We started in Ireland and right now we're in Japan. Yep, not bad. Not bad. So yes, we're nerds, but I know that there's a lot of nerds out there just like us, wondering what it's like to go to a Tokyo convention as a foreigner. Is there anything in English? No. Maybe a flyer. Are there subtitles? Nope. Download Google Translate? Do foreigners go? Kind of. Like 3-4% to 4 besides us. Do people wear costumes? Very few. And most seem to be part of the event. And there's a designated area to take your pictures. So what was cool about it? Quite a few things. For one, merchandise, learning about the studio's collection, seeing voice actors, watching interviews, and seeing the sneak peeks of upcoming seasons. But did we have a romantic anniversary? I think so.
Mitsui Garden Hotel, 10 out of 10 stars. The view was amazing, the breakfast was generous and delicious, and the service was pretty great. But the room might be my favorite that I've ever had. Now it's time to see the sights! Yeah. A few people have the same idea.
पहचान Enjoying the last rays of sunlight. 